Hello and records from the snowy Finland. In this video I'm going to introduce you new Mary Crusher MJS G series. We are going to talk about the features and the modifications what are made compared to its previous models. MJS G is one of our most sold PTO driven crusher models. It is suitable for tractors from 120 to 300 horsepower. It is available with two different working widths, 1.9 and 2.4 meters. Rotor diameter is 500 millimeters and max cutting depth is between 25 and 30 centimeters below the ground. It is available with two different transmission options. SDG or DDG. SDG stands for single transmission with gears. Then we have the side gearbox only on the other side of the machine, like in this crusher. SDG is suitable for tractors up to 250 horsepower. Then we have DDG, double transmission with gears. Then we have the side gearbox on both sides of the machine. DDG is for tractors up to 300 horsepower. This is how the gearbox free side looks like. We have bearing housing bolted to the side plate. Inside the bearing housing we use very strong pair of tapered roller bearings. As you can see this side is very narrow and the passive width is taken to minimum. In practice it means it is very easy to get this side going deep into the ground, even through frozen soil. Working can be done so that after the first pass the gearbox side travels always on a crushed surface. It helps getting the gearbox deep into the ground as well. That is a big benefit in these single transmission models what we can provide. Also in bigger Mary Crusher models. In general these MJSG models are very compact in size and light in weight in terms how much power can be driven through them. It makes the working more efficient and allows the working in much more challenging conditions in many many ways. Let's talk about the modifications of this new MJSG. Frame design is done similar than in its big brother MJHS. Frame is stiff, strong and light in weight. Wear liner, counter blades, all bolt mounted and very easy access to them. High strength steel is used in places where it is most needed. Lift arm brackets are bolt mounted, easy to change them longer for tractors with short lift arms. T gear is placed higher from the ground and the lift arm geometry is modified to match better with the tractors where the PTO shaft is higher from the ground. Let's have a look into the rotor chamber. Just give me a few seconds and I'll attach it to the tractor. MJSG is available with a wide range of options. Like in all Merrick Rushers, the customer can choose the rotating direction of the rotor. This machine is set with a uh, up rotation concept. Up rotation means that the cutters go up between the tractor and the crusher. And down rotation means cutters go down between the tractor and the crusher. Here we have hydraulic 
front plate. Front plate guides and controls the material flotation to the rotor. It also prevents the material flying towards the tractor. In up rotation machines, the front plate is necessary equipment. Instead of front plate, we can have a front mounted sizing screen. Then the rotor must be in down rotation setup. Have a look inside. There you see bolted adjustable counter bar. Counter bar is symmetrical. It means it can be turned once and the both cutting edges can be used. Placing of the front plate is optimized to match with the counter plate. As you see where the front plate ends, the counter bar starts. Bolt mounted blouse shape gearbox cover helps getting the gearbox deep into the ground. At the back we have rear roller. Roller is used to fell down trees and push down the vegetation when reversing. When driving forward roller compacts and levels the crushed soil. In wet conditions roller can be used to carry the weight of the crusher. Then we have Rear mounted sizing screen. Sizing screen makes the crushing result very, very fine in all conditions. See it yourself. When crusher is equipped with the sizing screen, you get all the jobs done by one machine and no separated high speed mulchers are needed for the topsoil mulching. You can work deep in the ground without compromising the topsoil mulching result. In this new MJSG, the opening of the rear screen is improved. It opens 150 mm higher from the ground compared to its previous models. Instead of a sizing screen, we can have a rear plate, either hydraulic, like in the front, or mechanical, when the plate moves with the roller. Like in all Merry Crushers, you can upgrade your machine afterwards with any of these options. Let's have a look into the rotor. As mentioned before, rotor diameter is 500 millimeters and max working depth of this MJSG is 25 to 30 centimeters below the ground. MJSG rotors have UNT cutter holders for 19 mm cutters, either with conical cutters or non rotating nut locket cutters. We called these eagle heads. Both cutters are custom designed to Suokone only and they are very affordably priced. For conical cutters, there are a very wide range of selection available on the market. In all Merrick rushers, the cutting speed of the rotor is low, but the torque is very, very high. Compared to other subsoiling mulchers on the market, usually our torque is 20 to 30 percent higher. And our rotors are very light in weight. When you work deep in the heavy soil, torque is the feature you need the most. Any extra weight and speed on your rotor is just slowing you down and increasing your fuel consumption. Benefits of these low speed, high torque rotors are following. Less tool wear, much less fuel consumption per hectare, Rotors does not require balancing. It means you can maintain the rotors at the side. You can make mixer of different colors, etc. Working near roads and buildings, etc. places is possible and much more safe because the rotor does not throw the material far. Thank you very much for listening. Please visit merrycrusher.com for more information.